and thank you for being with us here at VivaTech. Now, for our next two sessions, journalist Marion Moreau is going to be talking to two very important actors about their AI and digital strategies. First up is Ming Ang Zhang, the Deputy General Director of Huawei France, who's going to tell us how his company is designing intelligent technologies. Please join me in giving them a very warm welcome. everybody. Thank you for being there. I hope you, you, you have uh, some great time on this first day of Viva Tech uh, edition 2000-2003. Uh, that's uh, a lot of people. I'm really honored to, to host you on stage here at Viva Tech, uh, Ming Yang Hong, Deputy uh, General Manager of Huawei, Huawei France. Do I spell it correctly? Yes, Huawei. Good. Good. Thank you, Marion. It's, it's it's uh, now the, the fourth edition that Huawei is, uh, is partnering with the... Partner of Bibliotech, yes. That's good. Okay. Um, we're going to talk about AI during that session because AI is, you know, uh, very, very, very popular worldwide, I would say. I would say. Yes. Um, so, um, let me just uh, introduce you. So, you're Deputy General Manager of Huawei, as I mentioned. It's been a long time that you're... Um, how long have you been, uh, you know, have you had taken this role? Uh, it's, uh, for Huawei France, actually, I, I took this role from 2017 to 2018. 13, 18, okay. Yeah. Um, so, talking about Huawei, before we're talking about AI, because um, we, we want to know more about what is AI for a, for a, a company like Huawei. When we think about Huawei, we all, all think, I, I would say, about 5G. Uh, is, it, is it something that is a good summarize of uh, what is Huawei? I mean, only talk about the 5G is a little bit uh, reduced. Uh, actually, Huawei is uh, a tech company, a global tech company, uh, a technology provider in the different areas, uh, the information communication technologies globally. We, today we have uh, something like 207,000 employees of growth, the world uh, working in more than 170 uh, country and regions. So it's, um, um, I'm, I'm, I'm saying that we, we are really a technology company cover the different areas. We talk about AI, we talk about the, the, the digital technology and uh, such as 5G, yes. Yeah, well, it's, uh, it's core, you know, uh, of, of the old, um, a lot of technologies. But talking about, um, once again, AI, what play, uh, what role, sorry, uh, AI is playing uh, on, on the on my way and, and mainly uh, you know all the technology that you are developing yes artificial intelligence actually is you know from 1980s we talk about already today is very hot topics uh, for a company like uh, Huawei actually we our destination you know the intelligence is more our destination so um, we can say we we innov innovate um, a new technology, a new solution. Of course, uh, we, we try to, you know, to, to integrate, we try to create intelligence everywhere. Uh, the intelligent network, intelligent infrastructure, data infrastructure, intelligent everything. So this is um, very important, of course. Yeah. Intelligence, artificial intelligence is growing the different technology inside of the different innovation. Uh, of course, you know that Huawei is a Chinese company. China is, uh, is also on the competition uh, with uh, uh, com uh, competitive uh, AI technologies, a lot of patterns, uh, and we, we're, of course, uh, aware of that. Um, Everybody is now is, has been shaked, you know, with ChatGPT. You have a personal view on ChatGPT. Actually, since months, ChatGPT is really dominating. The, you know, the, all the stage, all the conversations. 
but the uh, chat GPT is not artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence is not chat GPT. Um, from, you know, from our uh, vision, um, artificial intelligence, we, we, we think that more than 98% of the application of the um, artificial intelligence is really in the B2B uh, area, such as I explained a little bit, uh, the different solution, the different you know, data infrastructure, the networks and storage, the data center, everything. You know, we, we, we talk about that intelligence, that artificial intelligence is, you know. So for you, once again, ChatGPT is not Chat GPT AI, is more. it's AI based. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I, I, I'm saying that, uh, you know, Artificial intelligence is not ChatGPT. Yeah. It's not reserved only by ChatGPT. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Of course, for me, um, ChatGPT is more the application, the B2C application mm -hmm. that we say um, in the future, especially you know the global. Of course, it's not well known the other to be B2B uh, solution in the. Activist intelligence is not loon by the public. That's why it's not much less than uh, ChatGPT. Mm -hmm. But ChatGPT is, I mean, activist uh, intelligence is not only uh, ChatGPT. Yeah, okay. Um, talking uh, back to the AI made by Huawei, um, what, do you have any uh, any uh, examples uh, of uh, what is AI uh, from Huawei, uh, from Huawei uh, perspective, and yeah, concrete illustration, you know, of AI use cases. Yes, I mean, I, I would like to, you know, uh, showcase uh, by one or two example to, you know, to illustrate uh, what is our vision on artificial intelligence, like application. When I say it, actually, like the, like the, 8% is really to be solution. For example, um, the first example I, I, I would like to, you know, to, to show is that, um, you know, in the pharmaceutical area, mm -hmm. uh, we usually we invest something like uh, more than billions of US dollars and for, uh, you know, uh, 10 years periods to, you know, to, to put a uh, new drugs in the market. So, Intelligence uh, that we, we develop um, an artificial intelligence by using 1.7 billion different uh, chemistry uh, compounds to you know to create the base and to add to help in the pharmaceutical industry to find out very quickly to solve actually um, artificial intelligence is really a solution. A solution to solve the different problematic in our daily life. So in this case, in this example, we using this program developed by Huawei, we help the pharmaceutical industrial to shorten the time yeah. of the you know the, the, the research and especially by using artificial intelligence to find out the most suitable compounds that accelerate that the, 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 um, the solution to find out the new drugs and then that, that's uh, the use, the one example. Yeah. Our vision on the artificial intelligence is really for our daily life to serve the humanity. This is our vision on the artificial mm. intelligence. To, to, before we enter in details, and we have a video uh, explaining uh, Maybe uh, yeah, that's, more, that's in a the more clear way, but maybe later on. Just to, maybe a word about your academic approach, because we all know that AI is science, right? We we, we all agree that iron is made by scientists. What 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 about academic approach uh, on on uh, at Huawei? Huawei, sorry, Huawei. Mm. Academic approach, yeah. All the technology, you know, somehow is linked to the academic days. That, that's why actually we invest a lot 
you know, um, something like a 25% of our uh, yearly uh, turnover in the research and development. So in all those research programs that we, we of course, we have worked a lot. We have a Huawei universities, and we have a lot of cooperation with the worldwide universities um, across the world, not only in China, but also in Europe and everywhere. So this is very important. This is very important, the, 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 the academic base. Yeah, yeah, of course. And so you mentioned health, healthcare uh, sector, of course, which has a lot of meaning, you know, uh, considering AI as a solution, you know, accelerating, um, you know, uh, the, the good for humanity. Do you have any other example that, uh, that uh, are uh, illustrating the yes, most we, valuable AI uh, solution? Yes, we have, uh, you know, for example, we, we, we had a program called um, Tech for All, Technology for All. The inside of this program, during more than 10 years, we have, uh, you know, we have uh, uh, the different projects um, using uh, the new technology, one of them that I would like to present here is the case of uh, you know, how artificial intelligence helping us in our daily work. Because our vision is really artificial intelligence uh, is, is, is you know, to, to bring the service to our industrial, agricultural, and healthcare everywhere in our daily life. So this is the example that I want to bring here about the uh, Love Salmon. The salmon, you know? Salmon. Really? You, the salmon. Yes. We have a, a video, I know that, of course, but you don't know. Let's watch uh, that salmon video, the, 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 the AI uh, use case that you have developed. Let's watch that. So. Ideen till projektet startet ikke så langt etter, det startet på Nordkinnhalvøya. Det var å fiske i et par elver der oppe. Og så hørte jeg hvordan de lokale var mer og mer opptatt av pukkelaksproblematikken som kom fra Russland. Og så tenkte jeg at dette er jo noe som vi må gjøre noe med. Her må vi kunne bruke kunstig intelligens til å finne ut av hva som er pukkelaks, hva som er atlantrasslaks, og så stoppe pukkelaksen fra å komme opp i elvene og ødelegge for laksen vår. Og neste steg da, det var å finne et selskap som både hadde kompetanse, kapasitet og gjennomføringsevne. Og det løser jeg jo ganske fort. Jeg er jo veldig glad i den nordlige delen av Norge. Finnmark spesielt. Jeg elsker å være her både på vinter og på sommer. Men jeg er også veldig opptatt at vi gjør det vi kan for å ivareta naturen og det magiske landskapet som vi har her oppe i nord også. So, uh, thank you for, for showing a uh, concrete use case. Do you want to comment and to add something on, on this, uh, this project? Yeah, very quickly, you, you can see through this um, video, actually from 2021, actually we got the case, we got the, the requirement from you know, those local association that are asking, asking us what we can help them, because actually you can see uh, they, are, they are doing everything to prevent this kind of a decrease of the low age salmon, that we all like the, the saumon fumé low age. So, but actually you can see from the 80s, 1980s, that decrease is more than 50% of the populations. So it's very important. So we, we, we took the case and then we spent nine months by establish this artificial intelligence, by using artificial intelligence to establish the model to identify what is uh, low age salmon, which is not low age salmon, and especially we call Pacific salmon which is uh, bringing the problem uh, to the, the proliferation of the, the low-age salmon. So by doing this, and finally in, in um, July 2022, 20, that we put in place the project after nine months of uh, identification, deep learning, everything. So we, we, see, we saw actually in the film that we got success to, to field more than 90%. So help 
a lot, a big help for the local fishermen association. So that's AI for good, AI for the service in our daily life. So that, that's our, you know, our goal, our promotion to you know, AI for good. And you want to accelerate. Is that, that uh, salmon project for, for local fishermen is uh, uh, intended to, to be continued to, uh, to follow? Yeah, you want to... Uh... Yes, this is the first step of the project yeah. to, you know, to set up the model, how it works. And after that, probably, of course, it's not decided by Huawei, but um, we can support to replicate, duplicate to the different, you know, in the lowest, more than 500, more than 500 rivers across the country. So a lot of salmon, you know, going back to there to, 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 to make the reproduction. Mm. Uh, that's, that's a way to, to get patterns from the nature, if I could summarize a little bit, uh, why AI's technology is, uh, uh, is coming and why. why what is the, the knowledge, you know, from the project? That's yes, yes. This kind of, uh, actually, this is also very important, that this kind of project that we can, you know, we can find any kind of uh, diplomat uh, problematic, then we treat it, and we extra as a model, then we train the artificial intelligence and then we can find a solution that's the beauty of the artificial intelligence okay right we, we do understand very clearly uh, uh, Mingong, your, your vision about AI but we are as you know in a very intense debate concerning AI at large you know a lot of people are getting fear with that because uh, a lot of reasons you know uh, it's accelerating a lot, maybe too much. Scientists have, uh, and uh, big players have uh, called for a stop, you know, uh, interrupting science uh, uh, and, and uh, of these advanced technologies. What is your opinion? Uh, do, do you think we, we, we have to fear a little bit and we, uh, with the rise of artificial intelligence, with the rise of artificial intelligent uh, generalized AGI. Mm. What is your view on that? When you ask me whether we, we have to be feared about this, my, my thinking is, is not f the question of fears, but the question of uh, prevention, the question of organization. Um, every new technology, inno every new innovation is uh, bringing some you know, something that scare us. Uh, we talk about 5G in 2019, if you uh, remember, so we talk about a lot of things. And finally, actually in the, in the work, especially, you know, the organization, when we talk about the new technology, the, 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 the artificial intelligence, we need to organize this. We need to probably, I think that, uh, um, to organize mean, means that we, you know, with the different countries, different organizations that we need to set up some roles, some, you know, discuss together how to, you know, how to prevent things that we don't want. So that means we need education in parallel of developing Education AI. and, of course, uh, to to make something as a prevention that is not only education but also I think that the organization you know from from I don't know from state area level or from you know um, the world level to make some it's not saying that oh we need to stop and then stop then what's the next step you know we need to organize and, and maybe, uh, is, uh, if I understand well, we need to, uh, and maybe it's the strategy of Huawei, to target specific sector, right? Such as healthcare, as you mentioned, agriculture maybe, uh, the way that we, we, we can put the technology at service of human, of people first. We, we are not targeting, you know, some of the areas. We are most, you know, more than, um, how to say, 
our vision is talking about is talking about the uh, uh, artificial intelligence uh, to serve our daily life. But how to serve our daily life? That's, this is the you know, concrete example we talk about uh, the Solomon, but we have a lot of this kind of example. We have a project uh, how to save uh, that, um, that um, how to say that the uh, mammifer um, in the deep ocean uh, in Ireland. We have a project also to do this kind of uh, prevent the, 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 the ship uh, across the, the, the channel that we have a lot of uh, uh, fish, we have uh, you know, the big fish over there. So this kind of all, we, can, we have also the project uh, how to protect the, um, um, the environment uh, by um, controlling, by hearing something you know, from the intelligence, uh, from the intelligence point of view that the voice, uh, the, 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 the different um, actions happened in the forest. So that's that kind of things. It's every our focus is really how to use artificial intelligence to help our activities, our daily world, daily life. Which is, of course, probably the most important. We thank you uh, very much, Ming Hang uh, Zhang, Deputy General uh, Director at Huawei France. Thank you very much for coming at uh, VivaTech on stage. Uh, maybe you, uh, of course, uh, spend a lot of good time seeing startups here, yes. I guess, you know, to yeah. meet a lot of people. Thank you very much. Thank you very uh, much. I'm going back uh, later on with a, a, a specific discussion on the tech in India. Tech uh, in India is, uh, is also a hot topic. Thank you very much once Thank again. You. Bye. Thank you.